eye on. So if you've got kids and grandkids, come a little closer for sure. I want to talk today about how to get crayon off of all the hard surfaces in your house. Now, the first thing you can try is a magic eraser, and it works pretty well on most surfaces. You're going to start, and you're going to rub, and you can see I'm taking it right off. If you're rubbing on a flat painted wall, be careful you don't rub the paint off too. Use it with care. Rub only as hard as necessary. Now, there's, there's an adage that grease removes grease. That's what you use on crayons. So we have Dissolve It and we have Goo Gone. And I want to show you how easy it is with Goo Gone to take off the crayon. Now, you can use this on any walls. Whoa! But on flat walls, you have to be extra careful. Now, we're just going to rub it. And you can see, gone, that easy. Now, when you're done, you wanna make sure you wash that with some hot soap and water to get that grease off of it. Now, another oil that you can use if you have it on hand is WD-40. And again, don't spray it on the wall or on the surface, spray it on your cloth and then just rub on your crayon, just like that. Now, if you have spots that have dents in them, divots, textured walls, make sure you reach for a soft bristle toothbrush to use for that. Now you can also use baking soda. Never use this on a shiny surface though because it will dull it. You're just going to wet a cloth, put some baking soda on, and rub gently. Now you can also try mayonnaise. Now full fatty mayonnaise works better than the light stuff, but the queen happens to have the light stuff at home. But Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. If it's the only thing you have at home, fine. Grab the mayonnaise and start working it in, but you're gonna have to work it in, let it sit for about 30 minutes to start to dissolve that grease and then come back in and rub again. Now, if you have any kind of crayon on wallpaper, never use oil. It will lift the backing on the paper and can take the print off of it too. Instead, use a piece of fine steel wool. This is extra fine steel wool. And I've got crayon right here, and I think it's kind of hard to see, but you're gonna take that steel wool and you're gonna gently rub with that steel wool. You wanna lightly glide it across the paper and it will take it off. But use care when you're doing it not to rub too hard. Now, if you missed anything, go to queenofclean.com for a printable copy. Check me out on Facebook and Instagram at Real Queen of Clean. And watch my videos at the Queen of Clean channel on YouTube. So thanks, guys, for talking dirty with the Queen of Clean.